The touring production of Benj Pasek and Justin Paul's Tony-winning best musical, Dear Evan Hansen, is one of this year's most anticipated theatrical events, and audiences across America are ready to experience this profoundly emotional show. We recently joined the show's creators an incredible cast, including Broadway favorites Ben Levi Ross, Jessica Phillips, Christiane Knoll, and Aaron Lazar at the rehearsal studio to chat about why this musical has captivated audiences and the impact this company hopes to make on theater goers everywhere. It's a beautiful, perfectly constructed piece of theater. I love the humanity of this show. I love how each person is so fully formed and nuanced, which allows everyone to feel connected to, if not one, but all of the characters. It's one of the great pieces of theater being done right now, and I feel like having done a bunch of shows, that a show like this comes along kind of like once every 10 years. The music and the book tap into such a vulnerable place in so many people that when you see it, you can't help but connect. And it's such a special show in that way because not many shows can touch you so deeply. People are, they've really been waiting to see this show and like America really wants to see it and it's never really played outside of New York. So it's, it's gonna be really exciting bringing this to a, a whole bunch of new audiences. I think we're really proud that, that there's such a high caliber of a cast going out on the road that people in Denver and LA and every, everywhere around the country are gonna to get to see um, a version of the show that we're so proud of and, and feels fresh and like its own thing. Dear Evan Hansen director Michael Greif shared what he believes theatergoers across the country will respond to when they come to experience the celebrated musical. I think they're signing up for a really full emotional ride. I think they're going to hear great, great songs. I think they're going to hear the best book of a musical they've heard in a very long time or maybe ever. I think for us the show is really about connecting and it's really about people who feel like they don't, they aren't able to connect with people around them and, and potentially the show gives them an opportunity to find other like-minded people who understand what they're struggling with, what they're dealing with, what, they, uh, what they're going through. You can tell there is a visceral response yeah. that the audiences and the fans of the show and the people who curate it and take such care with it have. I think the audiences of Dear Evan Hansen experience like this group catharsis of like, we all just went through something together, guys. I hope the audience is thinking about, uh, you know, our connections to one another as parents and children, as members of the same community, as neighbors, as friends, um, and the ways in which we help each other and hurt each other and the ways we listen to each other or don't. It's for everyone, honestly, because you have the relationship that the younger people have with social media and then you have the relationship that the parents have with their kids because of social media and because of how it's affecting them and I think it's it's an important show for everyone to see. I think we're really getting to a place in our society where like social media is really starting to affect human behavior in like a really real specific way and I think this show captures that beautifully in a way that not a lot of theaters doing right now. Um, which I thought was really cool. Oh my god.